Hello everyone. This time I'm going to explain one problem from the topic of determinant. Here's the question. A A square A cube B B square B cube C C square C cube equals to A B C A minus B B minus C and C minus A. Before starting this problem, uh, once you have understood first that <clears throat> for the determinant, if any particular row or column, uh, if they are existing element common, then it can be taken common out. But it should be common only in particularly row or column. Uh, likewise, you can see that in first row A is common. Uh, it means to say that first row consists A common and similarly second and third row consist B and C respectively. So uh, for first I'm taking A, B and C common from these rows. So writing down. <clears throat> taking A, B and C common from row 1, row 2 and row 3 respectively. So after taking a, b and c common, it remains 1, a and a square in first row, 1, b and b square in second row, 1, c and c square in the third row. Now, let's see in the proving part. Uh, we have to obtain the factors a minus b, b minus c and c minus a. For this, <coughs> we have to uh, do some iteration. If we are about to subtract b from a that is uh, if elements of uh, row 2 are subtracted from row 1 we obtain like a minus b a square minus b square and it will <coughs> it will obtain uh, a minus b as a factor and similarly we can obtain b minus c factor by subtracting row 3 from row 2 so let's do that a down operation on the right side row 1 is operated as row 1 subtraction row 2 similarly row 2 operated as row 2 subtract row 3 now doing so we get uh, first copy the elements of row first serially then get the corresponding element from row 2 subtracted 1 minus 1 a minus b and a square minus b square <clears throat> doing uh, same for row 2 uh, elements of row 2 are copied down same and corresponding elements of row 3 are subtracted from this 1 minus 1 b minus c b square minus c square and no iteration is made for row 3 so its elements are copied down same now a b c 1 difference 1 0 a difference b a square minus b square it can be formulated by the factorization a plus b into a minus b and similarly for second row 0 b minus c b plus c into b minus c and 1 c c square for third row now let's see first row consists a minus b as common term why can uh, we say so 0 means 0 into any number or any real number so 0 can be considered as 0 into a minus b for first row and uh, 0 can be considered as 0 into b minus c for second row so with this regard you can say that a minus b and b minus c are common in first row and second row respectively so they are taken common out checking a minus b and b minus c common from row 1 and row 2 respectively so we obtain a b c a minus b b minus c taking a minus b common from first row it remains 0 1 and a plus b and similarly 0 1 and b plus c for second row row 3 copy down same now <clears throat> we're just about to expand uh, and be pretty sure that from that particular row or column should be ex expanded which consists 0 uh, for simplicity so I am expanding from column 
first, which consists two elements zero. So say expanding from column one. A B C A minus B B minus C. Now uh, what about expanding? See the rule I'm writing down the rule at the top plus minus plus plus minus plus minus plus minus and plus minus plus this rule should be considered uh, while expanding determinant of three three order matrix so uh, its elements elements of tor first row first column are zero zero one zero zero and one so uh, with regards of plus minus plus so plus minus and plus and what lemons uh, are to be multiplied with these I mean I mean say uh, which determinants are to be multiplied with these elements the severe uh, th this very zero is a11 element a11 and its intersection of first row and first column and remaining elements uh, besides these uh, element these elements of these uh, row and column are 1 b plus c and c square so zero gets multiplied with in the form of determinant of these elements 1 b plus c c and c square <clears throat> and now for zero uh, this zero is element a21 which is intersection of column first and row second and leftover elements uh, except these elements are 1 a plus b c and c square so 1 a plus b c and c square and for the last one element 1 1 is <coughs> a31 831 and this is intersecting point of column first and row third and leftover elements are 1 a plus b 1 and b plus c 1 a plus b 1 and b plus c and take under call back it now <clears throat> a b c a minus b b minus c cup it down same uh, zero multiplied with any value zero so uh, it gives no meaning then <clears throat> for the last one expanding two into two determinant is to multiply elements of main diagonal first and get subtracted product of the remaining remaining elements so 1 into b plus c b plus c and 1 into a plus b a plus b and well uh, subtracted its sign changes i would say uh, bracket is opened by the sign minus so a b c a minus b b minus c uh, b gets cancelled so c minus a so we up to now final result all right, just a b c a minus b b minus c and c minus a i hope uh, you understood this and uh, you'll appreciate this thank you thank you for watching this video